This is the EcoFlow Smart Generator Dual Fuel. A dual fuel generator that supports liquefied petroleum gas, LPG, and gasoline for whenever grid and solar power is unavailable. In emergencies, you can use this dual fuel generator for extra power. Let's review the features on the smart generator starting with the front. On the front, you'll find an LCD screen to give you all the information you need. Below the LCD screen are alerts on carbon monoxide and oil levels. The generator automatically shuts off if carbon monoxide levels are too high or the oil level is too low. In the center is an electric start button. To the right of that is an AC power button to turn the AC outlet on or off and turn off eco mode. The IoT button resets the machine using a Wi-Fi or Bluetooth connection. Beneath that are two dust covers that protect an extra battery port and an AC port. Between these is the ground terminal. On the top, you'll find a fuel cap with a vent lever. On the left side is a starter grip for manual starts and an engine switch. There's also a dust cover to the left of the starter grip. Lift the dust cover to access the LPG inlet. On the right side, there's a maintenance cover. On the back, is a muffler to minimize noise. Now we'll have to look at how we prepare, start and stop the smart generator for the first time. To set up your smart generator, make sure the engine switch on the left side is switched to the off position. Then open the maintenance cover on the right side. Take off the cap at the base of the engine, add oil and then secure the cap then connect the battery terminals. Once you've done these two things, put the maintenance cover back on. Add gasoline in a well-ventilated area that is away from flames and sparks, remembering to put the cap back on tightly. To use the LPG inlet, make sure the LPG cylinder valve is in the closed position. Connect the LPG hose to the LPG cylinder valve and tighten it by hand without over-tightening it. Remove the protective rubber plug from the LPG hose connector. Remove the dust cover from the LPG access port. Insert the connector into the LPG access port and push it until you hear a click. Move the outer ring of the connector forward. LPG will only be used when the LPG hose is connected, otherwise gasoline will be used. To use gasoline, turn the fuel cap vent valve to on. If you want to use LPG, open the LPG cylinder valve and turn the engine switch to the on position. The smart generator's engine can be started via electric start via the app for remote start, via auto start, or it can be started manually. First, make sure the fuel cap vent lever and the engine switch are both switched to the on position. Then press and hold the electric start button to start the engine. After you have activated your generator, you can connect your app to your generator via wireless connection. You can then start the engine from the EcoFlow app. If your smart generator is connected to an EcoFlow power station via the extra battery port, the smart generator will automatically start to recharge your unit when the unit's battery is low. If necessary, manually start the engine by slowly pulling the starter grip until you feel resistance and then pulling it quickly. Before stopping the engine, 
safely disconnect any appliances and power stations. To stop the engine, press and hold the electric start button. You can also stop the engine from the EcoFlow app. If you need to stop the engine during use, first turn off the LPG cylinder valve, wait until the LPG in the machine is exhausted, and the machine will shut down automatically. Finally, turn the switch to the off position. In emergencies, stop the engine by turning the engine switch to the off position. Wait for the engine to cool, then turn the engine switch and the fuel cap vent lever to the off position. In LPG mode, remove the LPG hose from the LPG inlet and replace the dust cover. That's how to use the EcoFlow Smart Generator. Need more tutorials? Head to our EcoFlow Support YouTube channel.